Hey YouTube, this is Lewis with Rosebud's Travels. We have been watching many videos online on YouTube and hearing about the Oxygenix showerhead. And so what we decided to do is get one of the Oxygenix showerheads and change out our showerhead that came in our casita to the Oxygenix showerhead. So I'm going to show you how easy it is to change out the shower head in a casita for the oxygenic shower head, which gives you the sensation of more water by adding oxygen to the water and it makes it feel like there's a more volume of water flowing through the shower head. And it's supposed to be a, a more pleasant showering experience. So we're going to find out pretty soon. I'll show you how this works and uh, how simple it is. Okay, I'm going to show you how easy it is to change out the original shower in the Casita shower for the Oxygenics. So the original ones up here has a little cutoff switch up here at the top of the of the regular one. And then it has this fitting right here. We're going to use the same hose because the hose is long enough. And the, the hose that comes with the Oxygenics one is pretty long. And I don't think we really need a hose that long. And we'll, we'll hang on to it if we ever want to do it. But the way, the way you do this is you unscrew this fitting. And then that fitting is loose. Then you get the Oxygenix shower head and the cutoff valve that comes with the Oxygenix and you Teflon tape these threaded fittings and it comes with Teflon tape. So you use the Teflon tape and you do those in a clockwise fashion. So you put the Teflon tape on the fitting. One more time, put the Teflon tape on in a clockwise fashion. There we go. Then we're going to take the Oxygenix shower head and we're going to screw the cutoff valve to the shower head. Just hand tighten these fittings. Then you take the hose, make sure you have the washer that came with it in there and put this on the oxygenic shower head, tighten it up, get it pretty tight. Then there you go. And this shower head will fit up inside the original shower head holder and it'll hold it just fine. So I think we're going to do that instead of changing out to the other holder because you'd have to make new holes and this one actually will work. It'll hold it here 
So looks like it'll work just fine. So there you go. That's what's involved in changing out the shower head. We'll see you in the next video. If this video was helpful to you, please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to be notified for our next video. See you in the next video. Bye.